Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are looking at the PNY GeForce RTX 4070 Ti Super and this is the Virtu triple fan model which I like it a lot. It retails at RM4288. Now, why do I like it a lot? The performance, well, it's we'll talk about that later. But what I like about this card is that it is of a reasonable size, it's not super big like the 4080s and such. It's not that heavy, not, not that I mind when I place it in the case, but it's lightweight means you don't have to worry so much about sagging and all that. And I like that there's no RGB LED. It's totally just the shroud and the writings, no lights at all. That's just personal preference. Now there are more things I like about this card. What's nice about it is how silent it runs. You know, let's have a look at the thermals first before I go into the game's benchmarks. So you can see, I tried it on full RPM, which is 100%. So at 100%, it goes at 3600 RPM. And the temperature when playing Cyberpunk 2077 at, uh, one four, at 4K resolution, it did. And it was about 59 degrees Celsius. And that's manually setting it to 100%. However, if I set it to auto, it just peaked at 1200 RPM, which is about 33%. And the temperature is just about 70 degrees Celsius, which is very nice, impressive. So it keeps the card cool at 70 degrees Celsius, even though I'm in a warm environment of 28 degrees Celsius. This is Malaysia after all. And despite the auto RPM, which is what the the BIOS itself decides and it's running at just 33 percent it's so silent there's no point performing any recording of it and how does the card perform well it actually performs good um i have four cards that three other cards i compared with sorry not four there's total four cards in the in the, in the chart however i compare it to the just a 4080 a 4070 ti older number so Take it with a pinch of salt and a recently tested RX 7900 XT. With the comparison, you can see that it's an improvement over the 4070 Ti. It's slightly faster than 7900 XT, at least based on my test. And in some tests, it actually comes close to 4080, which I'm not certain yet, not enough time to uh, test, but just those are the numbers I'm reporting. Nevertheless, you get the idea. The 4080 is still a faster card. However, this brings the 4070 Ti range closer to a 4080. Now, what other things do I like about this card? Now, I'm going to stray a bit to talk about the PNY Virtual Series. The Virtual Series, they are using reference design. That NVIDIA's reference design, meaning it's one-to-one. -one. Everything is based on NVIDIA's specs from the PCB to the components used. And that explains why it is running so well at the that kind of temperature level. Now, I don't have any other brands to compare with, at least not yet. However, what I can tell you that if this card runs cool. That's why it can run on a cooler with not too many fin stacks, not, not too on the heavy side and it runs cool and above all, it runs really quiet, low RPM and still cools well because, on, um, and I dare say that this, the contributing factor is that it's based on the reference design because if the design is from NVIDIA, so the PCB, like what I said, and the components are all based on NVIDIA specs. Therefore, it can run more efficiently, lower power draw, does lower heat and therefore being able to run at lower fan RPM and lower noise. So that's the advantage of it. With that said, the PNY card here, if you're in Malaysia, look for, make sure you have this yellow sticker on it, which I'll give you a close up later, which is from the distributor, Fusion Tech Supplies and Jamba Hard. They're the official distributor of PNY graphics card. And if you buy a PNY graphics card and have that sticker, this uh, sticker, you are assured that you have an or original authentic product, not then you have the full warranty support and everything else. With that, I'm done with this video. I'd say this is an awesome card. 
and I'm going to leave you guys with footages of the 4070 Ti here running. And with that said, I'll see you guys in the next one. And bye bye.